Hello everyone and welcome back to WoW Classic. We are going to be headed back into the Dry Gulch Ravine today to take on some more harpies for the harpy kill quest we picked up. Securing the lines. We need 12 savages and we need 8 storm witches. After we do that, we're going to go back to the cave right over here in Skull Rock and we're gonna knock those quests out hopefully Some of you guys left some comments for locations of rare beast that we could possibly tame in the Barrens, and I really appreciate that. That's really cool. I'm definitely going to check some of those out. Oh, well, we actually have to get into the ravine, which I think we passed. Although, if we ever want to kill a bunch of boar to level up our skinning, we could do it right here. Be a good area to farm them. Would track humanoids locate harpies? It does. These are pillagers. We don't need pillagers. We need savages and storm witches. So we need to get back through that little cave entrance that we'd found before. Uh, but I think we're going to have to fight our way there. Oh, maybe we should take this one as a priority here. Not too bad. Okay, the cave entrance or tunnel is right ahead. What do we have in here? Maybe some food for our boar. Shiny apples. Yet to be proven whether he likes those or not.
Here we go, here's a savage. These are a little bit higher level than the previous ones. You guys pointed out that these were his loyalty ranks going up. One of those was an actual level and the other looked like it was a loyalty rank, uh, according to what some of you guys were telling me. We need to make our way towards some of the blue ones. Those are the storm witches. Uh, I only see one in either direction. Oh, there, there's some way up there. We could probably hit these. I would think. Yes, we can. Um, however, they're casters, so maybe we need to pull like way back. Um, oh, here we go. Alright, we need to feed our boy here, so that his happiness can go back up. Let's see if he likes apples. There we go. It only took one apple to get him back up to green, so... Maybe he does like apples. Maybe they're his favorite. Um, let's go ahead... Pull her. Ouch. Ooh, there's a few of them back here. We definitely went the right direction. I don't know if we have to, but let's just clear the ones up here in case they can aggro from above. That would be really unfortunate. Um... They didn't seem to chase after us. That did not work this time.
Okay. We could probably take them out potentially without the DPS from our pet. It's not ideal. They are hitting us pretty hard with uh, the lightning magic. Oh, now they're evade bugging. Okay. <laughs> we're, we're not messing with that one. We are not messing with that one. Yes, I just tried to put that bread inside my quiver. I, I do realize this. At least it automatically sorted it to a different bag. Instead of dropping it on the ground. Okay, we're going to ignore that one and hope that it doesn't aggro us from up there. Um, are we going to get two here? Nope. Yep. Ooh, what are those? Of the owl. Oh, they're cloth. We would have taken some, some spirit for sure. Uh, but not cloth stuff. Finding a lot of battered chest tonight. Basically all junk. Alright, so we still need some. It seems like we've slaughtered a ton of them. But we're going to have to go down this other way to get some more. And we're probably going to... Oh yeah, look. We actually do have respawns behind us. Oh, look, another battered chest. Do we have bag space? Mm, no, not really. We had bag space. Three battered chests later and we are basically full. I could send him out while I'm opening a chest. Amazing. Uh, them bags be full. That's where we just got to. It's the first thing here I'm going to drop. That. You know what? There we go. It's got to count for something, and at least to get uh, free space open in our inventory. Uh, and on that note, that's quest completed. We cannot get out this way, so we're going to have to come back the way we came. Which is going to mean fighting respawns, I'm pretty sure.
But honestly, I mean, respawns are not a big deal on the Hunter because we defeat enemies incredibly quickly compared to any other character that I've played. And then we have very little downtime between these fights. And if we go pull the pull, we eventually have to drink, but it's not for like six, seven, or eight pulls. So, I mean, that's like as good as it gets in Classic. And it feels pretty darn good, to be honest. Maybe we will get level 12 before we head back into that into that cavern. I don't know if that means we're going to get ice trap. I don't know when we get our traps. I feel like if we got ice trap right now, we, we might be overpowered. I don't know. We'll see when we're back up against the warlocks and their void walkers how overpowered we feel. That will be the true test. Test we failed previously. I don't know what I can say, it just feels good to fight stuff on the Hunter. It just feels good. It feels right. Turn this one in. And we'll see if it chains into anything else. Right and we'll stand in fire too, because that's always a good idea. Securing the lines. I think I could breathe easy now, knowing that the harpies won't be bothering our supply caravans anymore. And not one moment too soon, either. I hear I'm being sent some fun little toys with the next shipment. You're pretty good at what you do. You ought to track down my boss in Ratchet. I'll bet he could find you some work. Oh, and don't worry, I wouldn't forget to pay you for the services you provided. Oh yeah, that's right, we get the the bow upgrade. Keep it real. Oh, we would get the bow upgrade if, if we had inventory space. It's critical. Uh, these are the same as what we have. Is there anything we can just drop? Do one of those. Hey, how you doing? Be good. And we could immediately equip that for some extra damage. 
Which is kind of hard to think that we're going to deal even more damage now. Okay. Now when he said to go to Ratchet, he didn't actually have a quest for us. No, he, he was just telling us, hey, you could go to Ratchet. There are people there who might give you quests. Um, but he didn't give us a quest to go to Ratchet to talk to anybody specifically. It's a little weird, but yeah, eventually we will go to Ratchet. Eventually we will have quests that take us there from the crossroads. But for now, let's head over to Skull Rock.